May the 4th is Star Wars Day, and you know, why is it May the 4th? Well, may the 4th be with you. May the force be with you. <laughs> Get it? Well, anyway, I haven't done a Star Wars feature yet. I'm a huge fan of the Star Wars video games, although I don't like the movies that much, and I know I'm probably going to get shunned for saying that, but as much as I don't really like the movies much, the games are a whole different ballgame altogether. LucasArts are an amazing developer, and they, they made so many good games, and their Star Wars games just stand out as well. Really good level design, game design, graphics, attention to detail, sound, always at the forefront of what's technically new and exciting. Let's have my top five Star Wars games. Here's the list. Number five. Lego Star Wars 2, the original trilogy. This has to be on the list. Not particularly because I like it, but because you wouldn't forgive me if I didn't, right? <laughs> Vastly improving upon the original LEGO Star Wars, LEGO Star Wars 2 contains characters, scenes and areas from the 4th, 5th and 6th movies in the series. The gameplay focuses around puzzle solving as various different characters in the Star Wars franchise. I have actually achieved 100% completion in LEGO Star Wars 2, although I have never unlocked all the achievements. I ploughed hours into the game, and not including it on the list would be an insult to how much fun and frustration I had with the game. Number 4 Dark Forces You take Doom and you stick a Star Wars facelift on it and BAM! That's Dark Forces. You play as a wannabe Jedi named Kyle Katan, unfortunately he can't wield a lightsaber, but he is really adept at being an awesome rebel, laying waste to the Empire's goons and their plans. Excellent level design, almost maze-like, shows off the power of Lucasfilm's games and their incredible attention to fun and enjoyability. The length of the game is fair, and the difficulty is nice and steady, offering an experience well worth playing through. It's on Steam, so even the modern PC gaming crowd can take a waltz back in time to play this gem. Number 3. Full of awesome arcade-style action, Jedi Power Battles is a wonderful 10-mission game which takes place during the events of The Phantom Menace. It has some excellent level design, creative use of the Star Wars license, and an absolutely unbelievable amount of replayability. Playable in two-player co-op and alone, characters from Phantom Menace battle through hordes and hordes of enemies through scenes and locations from the film. Once you and your friend have battled all the way to the end, there's always the two-player versus mode as well, perfect for deciding who's the best. Number 2 The Force Unleashed for everything this game does wrong, there's at least two things it does right. Wielding the light and dark side powers of the Force, you'll be unravelling a mystery that takes place between the third and fourth films in the franchise. The story of this game is well written, and the characters are interesting enough and have depth. Even the tacked on love interest and character development is pleasing enough, plus the size of the game itself is commendable. Although the levels themselves are incredibly linear, I never felt like I was being guided through by hand. An absolute must for any Star Wars fan. Number 1 Star Wars Jedi Knight Jedi Academy Taking control of a new character, the Jedi trainee Jaden, you'll be working under the command and tuition of Kyle Katarn from Dark Forces fame. This game has an extensive multiplayer that has a huge modding community and fanbase, and the game itself has a robust and really enjoyable single player. I rate this game highly for its implementation of force powers. Who doesn't want the ability to wield light and dark force powers? Depending on how you equip and learn skills and the outcome of some missions, you'll ultimately decide and alter the path of the game. That alone makes it suitable for plenty of playthroughs before you even take into account all the character customization. The multiplayer is the ultimate land free-for-all with tons of maps and weapons and characters, with thousands of mods available. God bless mods. So there you have it, my top 5 Star Wars games, although really, it's hard to pick a top 5 with Star Wars games. They are all brilliant. That's it. It's over. I can't think of anything else to say. <laughs>